According to the new guidelines in my pyramid, everybody, kids, adults, you name it, needs to eat half of their grains every day as whole grains. So if you're eating bread and pasta and rice and cereal, half of those need to be whole grain. Now that can be a challenge if you've got picky eaters at home who refuse to eat anything that's not white. But I've got a few ideas. As a meal makeover mom, this is what I love to do. First of all, do the squish test. This is a whole wheat bread, 100% whole wheat. You squish it and it is squishy, just like white bread. Who could resist that? So don't go for the whole breads and the whole wheat breads that are very dry and almost kind of too healthy. Go for the squishy ones. You can also go for one of the new whole grain white breads. A Little bit of a trick here, but it is white in color it's still a whole grain. So you can look for that at the store. When you're baking muffins or pancakes or quick breads, you can substitute half of the flour with whole wheat flour. So if a recipe calls for two cups of say white flour, you can use one cup white and one cup whole wheat. Cereal for breakfast. If your kids are hooked on high sugar, low fiber cereal, get yourself 50% on your way to better nutrition by having half of the cereal as your low fiber, half of your cereal, as your high fiber. Top it with berries, a little extra nutrition there. Something else you can do when you're making grilled cheese is to use one slice of white and one slice of whole wheat. You can't tell the difference, so give that a try. This is a whole wheat blend pasta right here. It's made with part white flour and part whole wheat flour. So instead of just having whole wheat pasta, which tends to be kind of tough and chewy, and kids are gonna know they're having that. Can't trick them. Uh, you could try a blend pasta. And I think this is another great idea for, for families trying to get more whole grains in the diet. When you cook this pasta up and you top it with pasta sauce, nobody's gonna know the difference. One final idea is to go with one of these whole grain cinnamon swirl breads. My kids love this. Toast up a slice, top it with a little bit of butter or margarine, and your children will not know the difference between the white and the whole grain cinnamon swirl. So that's a really yummy idea. And I'll tell you, look in the market because more and more food companies have come out with whole grain products and the kids really don't know the difference. It's gonna make your job easier and make the whole family a lot healthier.